uh, we're doing a story on Bob Lazar. <coughs> Excuse me. He was a uh, supposed uh, a physicist who worked at um, a secret base in Area 51. He was hired to help reverse engineer alien spacecraft. And um, uh, so, you know, I'm doing a little bit of, you know, investigation on it. You know, um, I, I, I believe the guy, but, you know, they, you can't say anything until you actually, you know, investigate and, and look around. You know, I mean, like, I, I, you know, he seems like he's telling the truth to me, but, you know, I can't take it from him. I have to learn it for myself or it doesn't count. <laughs> so anyway, um, listening to his story, though, he said that he would fly from McCarran Airport to Area 51, which is this place right here. This is the Air Force Base, okay? He would fly here. Then he would leave here and go to another base called S-4, which is a, a, a another secret base. That's where they actually had the UFOs and stuff at. Um, he said he would get on a bus with blacked out windows, and then he would, they would drive around the side of the mountain to the southeast or southwest of the um, Papoose Lake bed. So I just decided, you know, I'm gonna try and follow it, you know? And I see one of these roses that leads out of here. So I, I follow it down. And one of the things Bob Lazar claimed was that he, um, uh, that the doors to S4 were, there were nine hangar doors hidden on the side of a mountain, like into the side of the hill. They were covered with sand and dirt and bushes and everything else. Uh, so it just looked like part of the desert, you know? I'm like, well, that's very convenient. It's like impossible for anyone to find, you know? Uh, but this is right where we're here. This is the uh, test range. Uh, this is where they tested off nuclear bombs. You can see all the explosions everywhere. I mean, this is like, this is a huge crater, if you can't tell. I'll show it to you guys. Really it's actually really neat, but, um, look at the size of it. Yeah, these, these are all craters around here. This is all huge, huge, just, you know, massive explosions and stuff. They're dropping bombs back here, back in the day all the time here. Um, but while I'm out here just looking around, and this is in the same direction. It's just like Bob Lazar said. I found something really interesting. All right, check this out. What is that? Look at that. It looks like a tunnel <laughs> with the door kind of open, you know? And I'm like, well, I mean, that's, it doesn't look like any of the other craters. If you tilt down, like, you can see that the, the rest of them are, in fact, craters. And yes, that is another one, all right? See, so you can see the rest, look, look, see how they, you can see they, they all, that's from the, the mapping of the, uh, of the satellites. But that doesn't happen here. That's because this isn't a, a crater, all right? <laughs> that's exactly why that would happen. Uh, and I know what you're thinking, because I thought the same thing too. I'm thinking, okay, well, is it a, you know, is it the position that I'm in? So, you know, I'm spinning everything around, looking for it, and it's all looking exactly the same to me. And I'm like, okay, you know what? It could be a trick of light and shadow and, you know, what have you. So, I decided just to go back in time. So let's see what happens when we do that. Look at that shit. Look at that. <laughs> it's, a, it's, it's totally open now. Like, and when you keep going back, watch. Boop, and now it's almost closed. Look at this. I mean, this is, th look. I mean, that's crazy, you know? I mean, is, is that, is that, <laughs> I, I just totally think that validates what he said. I mean, this is just this is just nuts, you know. I couldn't believe he's. He, I mean, and, and the same thing over here too, you know. This one, watch. And these are the only ones it does it to. Let's see. And bam! Look at that. I mean, that's incredible. Okay, so it's like, it's, it's got a door on it, like slides off the top or something, covered with sand. It looks like the rest of the desert, you know? You would, ne you would never know, you know? I mean, that's just, I, I just, I, I can't believe it sometimes. I, I, got, I got to get someone else's opinion in on this. Who, who do we have on the line? Richard, 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 are you there? Richard. Oh, I'm here, Ken. Richard Nixon? That's right. Old Tricky Dick is back. Uh, I thought you died. I did, but I survived. All right. Anyway, what do you think about this? Uh, and that is without a doubt, 100%. Uh, 
a fucking alien base. It is. It is. I absolutely, I'm going to have to agree with you. I mean, look, look at that, you know. I mean, without having actually any evidence of it, I'm going to have to agree with you on that one, Nick. I mean, look at that. What do you think is down there besides aliens? A bunch of Democrats. Oh, all right. Anyway, uh, yeah, so, I mean, look at this. This is, you know, and so I think this just helps validate Bob Lazar's story. 100%. Validation. Uh, all right, Nixon. Anyway, uh, and one another thing I found <laughs> I thought was really interesting. Maybe you guys can help me out with this because I, I I simply don't know. But I this is it shocked the hell out of me. All right. Let's see here. A fucking pyramid. Absolutely right, Nixon. Look at that. Up. What? What do they have a pyramid for? in the middle of Area 51. What is what is that pyramid for? Well, you know, Kent, every alien base has to have at least one working star gate. Huh. All right, all right. Uh, yeah, but I mean, I mean, it's still, look, is it, I mean, is that crazy? You know, that's, 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 that's absolutely nuts. And if, look, I know you're thinking, it's like a, a, a hill of sand and dirt for construction, you know, and in a couple days it'll be gone or something. Let's, let's get in the time machine. Let's see if we were right. Fuck no, we weren't. Look at that. <laughs> is, that's unbelievable. Look, look, and look at what. What is that little hole up there for? And this line. I mean, that's that's just crazy. Keep going back. I'm in 2006 now. I mean, it's always there. Look at that. Doesn't change. Everything else changes, but that pyramid is always fucking there. Look at that. That is crazy. It, you know, it makes me wonder. It, you know, I mean, <laughs> is it a Stargate? Hey, 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 Clark Kent. I didn't want any questions about Watergate. I didn't say Watergate. Oh, oh, oh excuse me. Oh, no. Anyway, no, I, I mean, I, I don't know. I, it's, you know, I don't think it's a, a, a Stargate, you know. But anyway, that, that is fascinating that there is a pyramid out in the middle of fucking Area 51. Um, but I don't know. What do you guys think? Uh, comment it up. Let me know. All right. Good night, ladies and gentlemen. All right, Nixon.